guys, so <clears throat> please excuse that my face is red. I have no clue what's going on with that. Um, but I'm so excited for today's video because I'm going to be watching the 1931 Dracula. I love that movie. If you are new to my channel and are not aware, I love vampires and I have mentioned many a time that I love this film. So I'm super excited to get to just watch it and then come back and tell you how much more I still probably love it. So, see you in a minute. Hey guys, so just got done watching Dracula 1931. Um, this was the first uh, non-silent film of the marathon. So we're getting into the films with sound, which I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually pretty happy about. Not that I have anything against the silent films, uh, but I just prefer them with sound. Um, and this is just such a great film. There's not really a whole lot for me, I feel like, to say about this film. Um, it's obviously based off of uh, Bram Stoker. I'm gonna say it wrong. Bram Stoker's Dracula, the novel, um, which I believe the movie by the same title is also on this list. Uh, so excited to watch that one. So this is definitely one of my like top ones that I was excited to watch for sure. I just, <laughs> it's such a good film. I love this movie. Uh, Bela Lugosi is amazing. Uh, fun fact, if you didn't catch my video where I talked about going to Zach Baggins Haunted Museum here in Vegas, I did do that uh, with Emma from Spooky Astronauts and got to see Bela Lugosi's mirror. Um, so if you don't know the history behind that mirror, there's information in that video. I'm sure link has already popped up by now. Um, but yeah, this is just, if you have not seen this one for whatever reason, highly, highly suggested it, highly, highly suggested. I did have to rent it, um, on Amazon Prime, but it was like, $3.99 to rent. Uh, you could also buy it on there as well. Uh, it's definitely one of the shorter films on this list. I feel like some of these like first few ones were actually pretty long. Um, I kind of like the fact that this one is a little on the shorter side, but I'd probably love it even if it was a long film. Uh, it's just fucking fantastic. Um, and pretty dark actually, uh, which of course I look for in my horror films so let me know if you have seen this one what your thoughts about it are in the comments below uh and let me know what your favorite universal monster movie is this one's definitely mine and i'll see you guys tomorrow with another video bye